Oh, wait, I'm not here. Memorial of Princess Diana. But you are not the first. Any time, any group coming, meeting the first tunnel. They say, oh, that's it, the tunnel where Princess Diana uh, could have this tragic accident. You see, just to know around his memorial. Well, anyway, from where the origin of the people of Paris, coming from the east of Europe, nomads. And this metro going everywhere. We have 14, one four, 14 lines and 275 stops why we can take the subway we move anywhere without any problem on the left side the same river i spell the same s-e-i-n-e -E. and this is the second longest river of france and this river coming from the east of france not far away you have to cross the same river the bridge and on the right side, you have a wonderful, lovely view of Notre Dame Cathedral. The first cathedral of France, built in 200 years with 800 years old. Look on the right side, the view of Notre Dame Cathedral. Look here. You see it? That is by the middle of the river. By the middle. We are going to pass very close. Don't be worried, but just to have the view from here. And if you look on the side of the river here, is the first open air museum. The first open air museum. To remind you, we have in Paris 82 <coughs> museums. In front, the first botanical gardens in Paris, 400 years old. The first botanical gardens in Paris, 400 years old. And the, the 17th century by the King of France, Louis XIII. That's it, the Seine River. river. Now we are here by the east part of Paris, and the east part of Paris is the old section. The west part of Paris is the modern section, and the most famous monument by the west part of Paris will be La Tour Eiffel, the Eiffel Tower. As I told you, in Paris we have one hand built in the year 1977. This is the Arabic words institute. The Arabs in France coming from North Africa is the first important community for this is the most expensive restaurant for one meal, not less than 700 American dollars. In 200 years, 11 the first prototype of the Gothic architecture and the Gothic architecture very strong architecture because the force of this cathedral coming from the roof why we could open windows without any problems the most important ceremony the most important ceremony inside Notre Dame was the coronation of Napoleon the 2nd of December 1804 Napoleon became emperor and France became empire so this is here the flying buttresses those arches and you will see the gargles on the top of the roof what is the job of the gargles to push out the water when it's raining like that no risk 
for the roof to be in trouble. Well, this is here, the man. There is the zero point, the middle of Paris, the middle of France, the Roman Empire. And now we are going to drive by the first street was open in Paris and the street it's Saint James Street and this is uh, the oldest the first street was open in Paris 2000 years ago a lot of restaurants attractive district we call it Latin Quarter like Latin language of the Sorbonne University many students with more than 450 <laughs> restaurants look this look this little street on the right here you have more than 50 restaurants inside the street look to the right and especially the night time it became very attractive with the because the latin quarter big district you have universities college schools and restaurants nothing else Two churches in Paris, and the name of this church, Saint Severin, 400 years old, Catholic church, and is still active. Paris was built in the year 1250. One Louis, the priest. And you will study with the Latin, why we call the Latin district. Today, this language is not... Five hundred years old, the name Cluny, C-L-U-N-Y, Cluny, famous by the tapestries, the lady of the unicorn. And you will see by Boulevard St. Michael, where we are, a very attractive section and very old section. You still remember I told you the first, second, third century, France, Paris, used to be part of the Roman Empire. And then on the right, you will see here some important monument Roman soldiers look here on the right and why the building after it's here with the medieval museum concerning the building in front if you look straight on it turning prosecutors coming for trial famous by the stained glass windows if you look now to the right we are going to go to the left but you look to the right you will see again Notre Dame Cathedral and that's it, the police headquarter and next in front of us La Conciergerie the first palace of the kings which is now the Justice Palace, where you have all the blue car there belong to the police for the security of this building. Concerning the oldest bridge on the Seine River, is this bridge on the right. The name of this bridge, Le Pont Neuf, the new bridge. In fact, the oldest and the first bridge was built by the stones. The year was 1605. Before this date, the bridges used to be by wood and this is the reason why we call it the new bridge, new technique, new creation. The stones was built by the King Henry IV. You see him on the right side with the green statue, the bronze. This is by the way, the first bridge was built with the sidewalk. And of course the ladies at this time used to be very happy to come here to walk. Very attractive when the weather is nice. And you will see all those green boxes. 
our little store selling old magazines, old pictures, old postcards. And concerning the French Academy, the building to the left, 400 years old, 45 40 members, I'm sorry, 40, 40 members are writers, poet, 40, uh, 40 members are poets, philosophers, and they used to work here inside this building. This is very attractive building, showing you the classic architecture. And what is the classic? It's copy of the Roman architecture on the French way. You see the the color, the capitals of the color, and the French way is the heart, but is on the left, must be the same on the right. We say negative and positive. And concern them in the world. Look to the right side. The Louvre. The Louvre meaning in English the name coming from the name of this terrible animal, the wolf. If you translate the wolf in French, meaning Louvre. This palace was built in 500 years, stone by stone, by 11 different kings. We start by the first king, Philip August, and the last king, Louis XIV. And since the French Revolution Museum in the world, you need by three good hours to get the guiding tour inside. The people doing the line, coming to see the Mona Lisa, painted by Italian artist, his name Leonardo da Vinci. In 1989, was the inauguration of the glass pyramid, dead by Iming Bay, by the middle of the courtyard of the Louvre. Again, today the Louvre is 800 years old, has been built in 500 years. We are turning to the right, and you look to the left over there, you have another important museum, Orsay, O-R-S-A-Y. You see on the left side, with those different colors, it's written Musée d'Orsay, and this is the first railway station in Paris, and this station was built in the year 1900 for the World's Fair of Paris. And the, this railway station is not active anymore since 1927. Is museum in 1986, the Museum of the Impressionist. And this is the French Gardens, what is named André Le Nôtre. And this is where it's our rest. Before I do for you the sign to go out, I want to check if it's not too busy. If it's busy now, we will come back after 15 minutes. And then I collect for each couple, $45 or $22.50. Now we are here by the rights bank, and the statue in front is the statue of Joan of Arc. Joan of Arc, excellent woman. She was the unique female soldier. She was fighting against the English, burning alive in 1431. Look to the right, the glass pyramid. Look to the right, please, there, the glass pyramid. This is the main entrance of the loop, and this is where we are going to stop. If, by the way, we stop here for lunch, the driver coming back at 2 o'clock. Well, I think we are lucky because I don't see any more buses there.